Okay, just in time for Halloween, it is an add a box reveal. Let's go ahead and dig into this. this re I received this about two days ago. Uh, I've done, uh, I think, one add a box, un open the box video for the channel, but uh, I think if you saw that, you know that I just love add a box. They are one of my favorites. So I'm gonna go through here and uh, let's see what we have inside. Okay, inside, oh, we got some goodies uh, that are roaming free in the box this quarter. I think Adabox um, had to take a little bit of a break and we didn't get uh, a box because of COVID. So this is a ketchup box, so I'm looking forward to this. Let's see what we have here. We have uh, in the box, we have the shipping information. A delayed game is eventually good. A bad game is bad forever. Shigeru Miya, Miyamoto. There we go. I'll get it out in a minute. So let's go ahead and take a look and see what we have inside. We did receive a mask in our last pack, so I'm glad to see another one. These are really nice masks. They always do a good job. So I am appreciative of the mask. I can always use an extra mask, and I like the black. I'm actually kind of hoping it has their logo on it. It does not. I, I would have enjoyed their logo. Uh, that would have been fun for a mask. But a plain black mask will be handy. Oh, it's nice. It's got the inserts for the filters as well. So nicely done there. Add a fruit. In here we have, what is this? Uh, we have a USB-C to, oh no, I think I, I may know what we're, we're going to be doing with this. To micro USB connector, we have an ear guard. This looks like an ear guard for our mask here, ear protector right there. And then we have some uh, screws here and we have some double-sided sticky tape. So that's exciting. Interested to see what we'll be doing there. Here is our pixel show card, add a fruit. Great graphics. I'm not sure who does their graphics uh, for Adafruit, and, uh, but they're, they're fun. They're always fun. So this is the Adabox 16 Pixel Show. It's just a blank to the left and then a sparkle to the right. And you can see this. I won't read this to you, but uh, here are the contents. We'll come back and look at those contents in a minute. Let's reveal them out of the box. Uh, I think I'll keep the card over here as a nice reference, though, so I don't mislabel something. That will be nice. Uh, let's go ahead and start with the white box here. Oh, this is kind of heavy. This feels like a, a wall wart. It is a wall wart. So that's good. A wall wart. This wall wart is... Looks like a switching AC-DC of uh, 5.25 volts and 2.4 amps. So that's a that's a pretty good wall wart. Go ahead and put that in there. Uh, power supply plus USB-C adapter. That is that piece that we showed here. So whatever we're powering, we're going to use the USB-C adapter here to use in conjunction with our power adapter. That's going to be fun. Uh, let's go ahead and see what kind of electronics we have. This is the Adafruit Matrix Portal super special let me go ahead and open this up and this is oh look at this this is interesting this is the matrix portal m4 you can see that here there we go right there and uh, on the other side we have this header connectors we have are these switch yep these are switches over here on the left so that's going to be interesting and here's that usb-c connector right there so we'll be powering this board with that power adapter using that USB-C connector. Here is the uh, Hub 74 RGB LED matrix. Be interesting. Look at these standoffs. Man, that, that's uh, pretty substantial. I'm gonna go ahead and place this back in the static bag. Next thing we have is a stand. It says this is the uh, bent wire stand. Keep your kit upright while you're working on it with a simple but effective stand. Yeah, simple. Should be effective. I like it. Uh, I'm going to go down low here and see what we have here. What is this? So this is some kind of plate. This is dif LED diffusion acrylic. This black acrylic adds some extra diffusion to your LED matrix project. This material is made of special cast acrylic that makes it perfect for glowy projects. So I'm not going to tear off the protective covering because I don't want to scratch it. So let's go ahead and set that aside. Okay, and we have this smaller box. This is the, ooh, wow, 64 by 32 RGB LED matrix, four millimeter pitch. This looks nice. This looks like a nice piece of tech in here, let me tell you. Okay, here's our ribbon cable. Here are some adapters. These are substantial, look at this. This is nice. And then we'll go inside here. 
Whoa, this is nice. This is a good get this quarter for this package. Look at this. Matrix lights. So that uh, diffuser should fit just perfectly, and it does. So I'm sure that'll be part of it. We'll set that diffuser over it. This is the 64 by 32 RGB matrix, over 2,000 colorful LEDs, the most LEDs of any at a box. Plug it into the matrix portal, which is this piece here. We're going to plug it into this. And on top of that, and use our Arduino or CircuitPython libraries to draw and animate. This is going to be so much fun. I'm really looking forward to this. Um, this will allow us to light up this matrix using various colors, uh, 2000 colors, and we can have anything go across. You know, I've been looking for, and I'm sure for the holidays, you would want to use it for the holidays, and there's probably um, a couple of tutorials that'll run us through, maybe a Halloween example. But I'm really excited about this because I've been looking for something that I can place upstairs at the top of the stairs that says recording when I'm recording so that nobody comes down and bothers me in my makerspace, my geek cave, my whatever this is downstairs. So this is very exciting. So let's go ahead and recap again. So we have the board. We have uh, the, the 32 or 64 by 32 RGB matrix. We have the Adafruit matrix portal. We have our wire bent stand. So now we know what the stand is for. The portal will or the uh, matrix will sit on that. We have uh, the machine screws, which are in here. I have to figure out how those come into play. I'm sure it's, this probably screws onto the back of this somehow would be my guess. Um, I didn't look at the back. Did we look at the back? Let's see. Yes, there you go. There's uh, places for uh, screws to uh, happen. So we'll figure that out as we go. And then we've got all of our jumpers, uh, cables, and you can see that these are gonna go in here. So going back again, let's go ahead and our RGB matrix add a fruit matrix portal, our LED diffusion acrylic, our adhesive squares, which are in here, our power supply, which is right here, our bent wire stand, which is right here, our machine screws, which are here, our important face mask, which is here, and then our ear saver, which is in here. There you go. There's everything that's included in add a box. 016 and I'm looking forward to diving into the project and I already have I can think of at least 10 uses for this that I would like to try if you like this video hey hit like and subscribe all that business down at the bottom uh, whenever I receive an add a fruit box I'll be sure and do an open the box segment and uh, I've not done a follow-up to an open the box yet but I might this one might be the first one where I actually dig in Go ahead and put it together and do a follow-on project. We'll have to see if timing will allow me to do that. So you're going to want to hit subscribe so that you know if I do a follow-up to the Open the Box. So thanks for watching this Open the Box at Adafruit 016.